In this video, we will divide integers. In dividing integers, just divide the numbers and put a sign to the quotient. The quotient of integers with like signs is always positive. And the quotient of integers with unlike signs is always negative. Sa pag-divide ng integers, i-divide lamang natin yung numbers at lalagyan natin ng sign yung quotient o yung answer. Kapag pariyo ang signs ng integers na ating i-divide, positive sign ang ilalagay natin sa answer. At kapag magkaiba naman ang signs ng integers na ating i-divide, negative sign ang ilalagay sa answer. Okay, so i-divide natin ito. Negative 35 divided by negative 7. I-divide lamang natin yung numbers. 35 divided by 7 equals 5. 5 times 7 equals 35. 35 minus 35, 0. Ito yung quotient. Ang quotient ay 5. Ilagay natin yung answer dito, 5. Then, lalagyan natin ito ng positive sign. Dahil yung dinivide nating numbers ay pariho yung sign. Pariho silang negative. Kaya, yung quotient o answer ay positive. Ang quotient ay positive 5. Ito naman ang i-divide natin. Positive 28 divided by positive 2. Kapag mag-divide kayo, gamitin ninyo yung long division, lalo na kapag matataas yung numbers. Long division ay 28 divided by 2. Ganyan lang yan. Okay, 2 divided by 2 equals 1. 1 times 2 equals 2. Subtract. Then, ito bring down. Bring down 8. 8 divided by 2 equals 4. Multiply, 4 times 2 equals 8. Subtract, 8 minus 8 equals 0. Walang remainder. Ang quotient ay 14. Okay. 28 divided by 2 equals 14. Then, lalagyan natin ng positive sign. Dahil pareho yung sign ng Dinivide nating numbers. Ang answer ay positive 14. Sunod, negative 36 divided by negative 9. Okay, 36 divided by 9 equals 4. Then, ang sign nito ay positive. Dahil pareho yung sign ng numbers na ating i-divide. Ang quotient ay positive 4. Dito naman, mag-divide tayo ng integers na magkaiba yung sign. I-divide natin ito. Negative 40 divided by positive 8. I-divide lamang natin yung numbers. Okay, 40 divided by 8 equals 5. 5 times 8 equals 40. 40 minus 40, 0. Ang quotient ay 5. Okay. 40 divided by 8 equals 5. At lalagyan natin ito ng negative sign. Dahil magkaiba yung signs ng numbers na ating i-divide. Kaya negative yung answer. Ang answer ay negative 5. Next, negative 18 divided by positive 2. Okay, madali lang. 18 divided by 2 equals 9. At ang ilalagay nating sign dito ay negative. Dahil magkaiba yung sign ng numbers na ating i-divide. Ang quotient ay negative 9. Last, positive 100 divided by negative 5. Okay, i-divide natin. 
100 divided by 5 equals, eto muna 10 divided by 5 equals 2. 2 times 5 equals 10, subtract 0. So bring down 0. 0 divided by 5 equals 0. 0 times 5 equals 0, subtract 0. Okay, yung quotient ay 20. 100 divided by 5 equals 20. At yung sign na ilalagay natin dito ay negative. Dahil magkaiba yung sign ng integers na i-divide natin. So, yung quotient ay negative 20.